you can change your, your handlebars, right? So, to first of all, take off the bar tape. Second of all, take off the old levers. Uh, so, you can just see Louis, my friend, who is a mechanic in the UK, um, who's helping me do this. He's just explaining everything to me, which is pretty beautiful. Then, so you're taking off the handlebars, pretty beautiful. You can see the stem. He's just weighing them, seeing the difference. It's about 50 grams saved, so not too bad. But anyway, so he puts on the new handlebars. As you do, making sure just the position's the same. Like, it's best to try and take a picture of your position before of, like, the levers and the slant of the bar. So, you're trying to get the slant right. Um, I have a pretty weird lever position. Uh, it's pretty, like, weird. But I don't know, it's just far forward. That's sort of how I like it. Anyway, so he's just t tightening the stem bolts, make sure they're all good. Uh, make sure, obviously, they're all torqued to the right, uh, right setting. And then, after the old uh, handlebars are in the right position, make sure they're all, like, tight. Make sure they're all stiff, we're leaning on them. Pretty stiff to be honest, like we're leaning on them. You put on the old uh, levers, so if you just slide the levers off, levers off, you don't have to change the bars or any, uh, the, um, what's it called? You don't have to change any of the cables, which is pretty good, so we didn't change any cables, just slid them off. So you can see now Louis just making sure the bars are on the right right side on both of them. Uh, sorry, the right height on both of, the, both of the bars. Angry Vegan makes a little appearance, having a look what we're doing. Uh, and then making sure they're just in the right place. So I was just having a feel, getting on the bike, seeing how they were. We're checking if, they, you need, if there's any like specified torque for them, but there isn't. I think you just tighten them so they don't move. Because to be honest, they're only going to move in a crash. And then you basically wrap the bars up after you're satisfied with the lever position. Um, so you can re reuse your old bar tape, get some new bar tape. I'd recommend getting some new bar tape probably. I'm using my old one and it's uh, not great, but fresh handlebar, fresh, fresh bars. The reason I changed my handlebars is I went from 42s to 38s. I'm enjoying the 38s quite a lot already, I've only ridden them a bit. Uh, the sprint they feel good, the cornering they feel good, going through traffic and just riding next to other people it just feels a lot nicer. And for me, I'm not a huge rider and my shoulders aren't that wide so it sort of makes sense to have a small one. You can see you're getting in a bit of error position here um, and you'll see in a minute that um, we compare the size of the bars and you'll see it's, it's, it's a reasonable size uh, difference. Obviously it's only it's 4 centimeters, so it's 2, two centimeters each side, so here you go rolling them up and you can see the difference in the size. So yeah, cheers for watching, see you in the next vid.